Hi, Shayla. <coughs> oh my God, it's so dusty. Hello, hi. Oh my. Hi Luna. Hi Kaylee. Hi Edits by Soph. Hi Horse Twins Play Roblox. Hello everybody. Oh no problem Kaylee. I'm so glad a lot of you guys came back. If you guys were at my previous live, thank you for joining. This is the banana I will be feeding Rococo. Yes, Echo Strain. All right, who's ready to see Rocket eat a banana for the first time? I've never given him a banana. Banana? Yes? Okay, I'm gonna open it. Yes, here we go. It smells bad. I hate the smell of banana. Why banana? I don't know, I just never given it to him before, so I feel like he's just gonna give it a go. Run it. Yes, I am back, you point of mine. I hope you guys enjoyed my first live. Rocky. Banana. Ready guys? You can eat it. No, smell. He's scared of the banana. You can't be scared of it. It's food. It's carrot. It's a white carrot. No, it's not. Oh, there you go. What do you think about that? Banana? Banana. All right, it's rocket approved. He likes the banana. Do you like bananas? Well, now I know what to do with the old bananas that my mom and I won't eat. Bring it to Rocket. Oh, he likes it. Okay, Rocky Banana. Oh, he loved it. Oh, that's the fastest I've ever seen anybody eat a banana. Oh. Do you like the banana? He likes bananas. Okay. And then I have some more carrots for him. We're going to put it in his thing. Because I don't, I don't like how he eats my arms off anymore. You know, it's not very cute of him. I would hand feed him on camera, you guys, but I'm being abused for it, so it's not happening. It's not going to do that. Yes, it's a fly mask. You're the he, girl on TikTok. I am. <laughs> I got TikTok recognized. Thanks for following. I'm dying. I got recognized, guys. I'm all blushing now. I never get recognized, but it's really exciting when it happens because I'm like, whoa, people know they exist? That's crazy. You know? It's pretty crazy. When people know you exist, you're like, whoa. Thank you, Luna. Thank you, you kind of mine. Okay, so I had to give Rocket carrots in there because I've been having a problem where my man's has been killing me. He's been attacking me because I won't give him carrots. So now he has to learn that he only gets carrots in there and that my fingers and my arms are not carrots, though they do resemble carrots. I'm sure they do, especially because I am a noodle. But yeah, what the heck is this title? Mark, you missed Rocket eating a banana. You missed it, Rock Mark. Yes, Eli. Mark, I can't believe it. You're gonna have to rewatch it. Rocket ate a banana, so get on his level. Gee, Rocket is a big horse. He's a big boy. He's so handsome, yo. He is. You're catching up and stuff. That's okay. That's fine, Rocket. I won't. I won't judge you for that. Wait, I think I just called Mark Rocket. I won't judge you for that, Mark. Well, 145 lip balms. Oh my lord. Shook. Okay, guys, I think we're gonna be on here for like 10 minutes and then your girl's gonna go home because my back hurts. <laughs> it was so fun for you guys. Oh, yay. It was so fun for me to like go live like that and hang out with you guys while riding. He was really talkative. Yeah, let's play more Horizon, Mark. The answer is yes. Does Rocket eat potato chips? Um, I don't want to give them potato chips just because I don't think that they're really healthy. They're not even healthy for humans, so I know they're not healthy for a rocket. And he's like, okay, here's the thing. If I had a child, like a human child, I'd give them potato chips because I don't know. <laughs> I'd be a terrible mother. I'm kidding. No, okay. 
I'm like a horse mom and I want to keep him healthy. I don't want him to get sick because he's an animal and like it's different. When humans are sick, it's like, oh well. But like, <laughs> what am I? No, okay. It's different, you know? Animals versus humans. They get sick and then they die. Whereas humans are just like not dying from eating potato chips. So I don't want him to colic. That's the bottom line. I probably should have just said I just don't want him to colic because he could or have um, diarrhea. Oops. Or have diarrhea. But instead I was like, if I had a kid, I'd give them potato chips. So they don't. <laughs> this is why I should not be a mother. But then again, all mothers give their children potato chips. So I don't know what I'm talking about, honestly. I just want potato chips right now though. So thank you. Okay, if I was vegan, I would have my child be vegan, but at the age that she was, I mean, they can make, she, did I just predict the gender? Okay, whatever. The age my child was, if they um, didn't want to be, I mean, I would like hate them or I would respect them, but I want them to be educated on like how animals are treated. I'm not fully vegan though, so I can't even say it, but I think I will go vegan one day. It just depends. I don't know yet. It's really hard. I might go vegetarian though. Well, I don't know. I might go vegan, I don't know. You guys have no idea what my life entails. It's all just playing it by ear. I'm like, I'm like vegan one day and then the next day I'm like ramen, chicken, Chinese food. So it's really difficult. And canes, like I really, ugh. It's hard to, okay. I'm feeling guilty guys. I'm feeling guilty. I saw this TikTok where it was like, can you love animals and eat them at the same time? And she was like, no because she's vegan, and she's like, you can't love that animal and eat them at the same time. And I agree with her, like I can't. But I love chickens, like I just enjoy their existence, but then I also like to eat them. Like why, oh my God, it makes me really upset. Like it's really making me, it's really grinding on my on my, my soul lately. I'm like, should I give up eating chickens because I love chickens? Because that's what I did with pigs and cows. But it's really hard because they're just so good. Okay, that's it, thank you guys. As passive aggressive? What's passive aggressive? Me, oh, me loving chickens but eating them? I know, it makes me really upset, but I'd like to eat them. Oh my God. Rocket. <laughs> Rocket's like, I actually don't even care. Having dietary restrictions is literally impossible for you? Oh my gosh, Mark, poor you. What a poor guy. Oh, Rocket, do you like chicken, Rocket? Rocket's a vegan, he's so vegan. Actually, he eats humans, no. You eat humans? Yes. yes. No, don't eat plastic bags, no. He also eats plastic bags because he's a turtle. You're a fight turtle. Only turtles eat plastic, yes. You judge me on what I eat? Yes, I judge you. No, I'm kidding. I only judge you when you eat red meat. That's okay, though. Right, Light Fury? Oh no, I'm horrible. It's just a dilemma that I don't have time to face at the moment, but we will one day. I just have to, you know, I need a good chicken substitute because there's good chicken nugget substitutes, but like, it's really hard when there's chicken and like sometimes it just tastes like, like a mush, not mushroom. Uh, it's just sometimes like vegan chicken tastes like, what's the thing, tofu. And I just hate tofu, so it's just difficult. Like, I can't stand vegan chicken nuggets in anything but vegan chicken nuggets. Which makes sense because in chicken nuggets and anything sounds gross to me, but like, like a chicken with like barbecue sauce sounds lit. Oh my gosh, I don't even know. I know, real chicken, it's like, it's hard. So I need like a substitute because I have a substitute for shrimp and there's actually more shrimp substitutes coming. So in the future, there's gonna be a shrimp substitute and shrimp is also my hugest weakness ever. And I can't say I love shrimp of the ocean because frankly, they terrify me. Like if I saw a shrimp, I would cry because they're scary looking. But then I also don't hate them because they're just vibing, you know? But anyhow, um, I feel like in the future, they're gonna have like this like brand is coming out with substitute shrimp. And I would definitely try it. And if I like it, I would eat that instead of shrimp because I don't need shrimp. But chicken is just a different breed. There's so many variations of chicken. Why am I talking about this? Anyhow, do you remember how it felt first time riding a horse? Yes. Okay, wait, I'll give you guys three scenarios of first time riding a horse. So the first time riding a horse like ever, I was terrified. I was like, I'm gonna die. But then I didn't die and it was kind of fun and I liked it. And I was just kind of jogging. 
So that was it. And it took me a while to really want to canter. Then the first time I rode a polo horse, I feel like that will count as my first time really because that is the best feeling ever. And then the first time jumping a horse was incredible. It literally, once you jump a horse, it's like a drug. Honestly, I've never had drugs, but I imagine it would be like that. Well, hopefully not. It's like that, but like minus the unhealthy stuff. Yeah, Rocket is sneaking food out of his hay bag and I don't know if I should stop him. Should I stop him? Probably not, too lazy. He has too much hay anyway, so he needs to eat some. But then he's gonna get chubby. So many dilemmas of life. Okay, he's stealing hay. He is, he's, some, he's sister snatching. Silly boy. Okay guys, I think I'm going to end the live just because we went live earlier today and I just wanted to show you guys Rocket eating a banana. I thought that was just something to be recorded and documented in life. Anyway, thank you guys so much for joining my live. I'm gonna go have dinner, relax, my back is a little sore and um, I hope you guys have fun, have good dinner, lunch, breakfast, whatever time zone you're in and yeah. <laughs> and say hi to Rocket. Hi to Rocket. Can I go live at home? Not today, but I'll go live at home another day. Okay, everybody, say bye to Rocket. Say bye, Rocket. Bye. Come on. Bye, bye. Mark, you missed the banana. You suck. Just kidding. Love you, Mark. Okay, bye, guys. <laughs> I can be mean to Mark because he is my BFF in real life, but I won't be mean to you guys. <laughs> okay, bye guys. <laughs> Love you.